Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Wanchiko. It's been a minute, you know? It's been a minute. Content creation is not easy. Imagine it's not easy. So if you're outside there and doing it, thumbs up, kudos, you're doing an amazing job. Just creating the time and everything, it's not easy, but tutangangana had it to fike. So if you're new here, karibu sana, feel at home, subscribe to this channel because I promise you, this is where you belong. I have amazing content for you. I am uh, looking forward to spending amazing, amazing days and, uh, you know, with you guys. Everything good with you guys. So, guys, I asked you on uh, my Insta. Was it Insta or Facebook? One of the, uh, of the two. I asked you to share uh, ideas on what you want to see me do because ideas are ziku kwa zinakuja. So you guys were like, Prank, 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 and it's not easy, especially being that everyone around me knows that I have a YouTube channel. I started a YouTube channel, so they are extra cautious around me. But guess who doesn't know I have, I have a channel yet? Mm -hmm. My mom. So maybe from the title of the video, you already know that it's my mom I'm speaking about. My mom doesn't know that I have a channel. And fortunately or unfortunately, she will be my first victim. So um, I'm planning to go, uh, to go visit her uh, where I live and where she lives. It's not that far. So I think I'll, uh, yeah, I think I'll take a matatu uh, to her place because this prank has to go down. So I, I don't know if this is a prank or it's a reaction video because let me just bring you up to, uh, up to speed now what I want to prank her with. So now some times back I was uh, applying for a, uh, a scholarship in Canada, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was applying for a scholarship in Canada. Hi, Gwenda Kruili Gongamwamba. So please don't ask me anything to do with the <laughs> Canada my scholarships. So uh, I was applying for a scholarship to go to Canada, but uh, Ika Gongamwamba, and she knew about it because she was like, yeah, you know, I'll pray for you, and uh, it has to go through. But unfortunately, uh, or fortunately, it didn't go through, and uh, yeah, that is it. So now. Uh, I want to tell her, since she, she's aware that I was applying for the uh, scholarship and she didn't, she's never even asked me how it went and I've also never bothered telling her or giving her feedback because I could go through, so no need. I want to tell her now that I've gotten a, a response, I've gotten an invite of the scholarship. Hmm? So I know she will be very excited for me. I want to tell her that and... Now, this is where the uh, interesting bit will be. From uh, the invite, they are, we are 10 of us, and uh, they, are, they have to choose like five of us. So, and they are choosing depending on your background story, yeah? So uh, you have to really give a good story, a, a story that uh, will uh, tell how your childhood has been, uh, the struggles that you've gone through, and why you deserve the scholarship. So when you have a sit down with her, I am going to lie. I'm even going to cry if it's a, if it's a bit. <laughs> so I'm going to lie uh, how, you know, story when you, I'm just going to give stories that were not there or stories that have not been there. And I want to see her reaction. Will she support me with the lies? Will she flow with my lies? I'm at a call like, stop, we cannot continue. So I want to see the reaction in this video. So if you're still watching this, then the video was a success if not then i think i'll just stop it for myself to be watching but i really hope it goes through so it's currently around 10. i want to uh, leave so that i can catch a matatu and uh be with her. okay so i think the next time we'll be seeing this video i will be with her doing this video hi guys so i am at home meet my favorite Person, this is my sweet little brother's baby. Mwah. Say my hi, guys. 
Say hi guys. So yeah, guys, I'm finally at home. So let's go and meet mom. So so mom, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I support. I support Missouri. So I am not going to go to the insist. I will get the chumpy. I will get the cure. The cure. You know what I mean? Ah, once I'm like you, no. Hmm. My my thing. Ah. No, I'm not going to go to the moon. No. Can I do the trip? Hi, Kenya. Okay. Thank you very much for uh, giving me this chance and even. Uh, just picking me to be among the qualified candidates, uh, among the 10, I don't take it for granted. And uh, just as you had requested for me to do a background uh, story with my mom or with any of my family members to take you through of uh, the struggles that uh, we have, uh, rather I have gone through until today. And uh, that is why I feel I, I really need the scholarship. So uh, from childhood, just uh, maybe I'll let my mom introduce herself and uh, say her name. Hi. Kwa majina naitwa Jane. Jane Jerry Mothe. Mama ya Consolata. Mtoto ule mdogo kwangu. Na shukuru sana kwa sababu mnipatia hii nafasi ya kuongea na kujiintroduce kwenye. Consolata ni mtoto wangu wa mwisho ani kona wengine watatu mbele nashukuru sana na pia hata ipo nashukuru vile hata Mungu ametutendea na hata pia nimemlea pia na nisita mashida nyingi lakini kwa uwezo wa Mwenyezi Mungu akipata hiyo nafasi hata mimi najua naweza amka na nini mbali kidogo asanteni okay so just as uh, you have had Mom, don't worry, uh, they are interpreters and uh, they will interpret what you just said. So just as you have heard, my mom has really struggled to take care of us and being that I was the last, in a, we are four kids, so being that I was the last born, most of the times I find uh, myself uh, having uh, remained back at home with her as the rest went to school and uh, therefore I can say that I know uh, rather I've been with her during uh, that part where the, she struggled most and uh, it has not been easy even just uh, thinking out uh, thinking about those uh, times uh, right now uh, the memories and everything uh, really breaks my heart but uh, we are glad that we are no longer there so maybe just to take us back I remember uh, my mom has a uh, Technically, she's taken care of us a lot uh, since my dad was uh, working in Mombasa and uh, the little that he would get there was not even enough uh, to send home. So she was, uh, she technically she took care of us by herself and uh, Biashara. So I remember this time um, we didn't have anything to even eat and it was so hard for us. So the others had gone to school and uh, my mom had to go and look for something to do so that she can find uh, just a little for us to, for, for, for her to get something to put on the table. So she went uh, with these, uh, you know, these kufua jobs. Kufua manguo, kwa majirani, panya panya kazi kwa majirani hili tuweza kupata kitu. So she went to uh, to to one of her uh, neighbors. Uh, not uh, they were not really neighbors, but we were just uh, the way you could just walk and look for jobs. And she happened to get a job. Therefore, we went with her, and she was given a pile of clothes to wash. And uh, we washed them with her. We really washed the the clothes, and uh, we had not even taken breakfast, not even lunch. So uh, she asked me to, to go to the fridge. We were in that woman's house to go to her fridge and maybe just steal something to eat. Yeah. So I stole and uh, I they found out and I was 
we were I was beaten so much and um, even for her we were chased from that house and it was so hard that day we didn't even have something to eat and from there it has just been a struggle from one door to another borrowing money not you know there's even a time we had not paid rent and the landlord even kicked us out the landlord kicked us out we had nowhere to go my brothers and sisters came back from school they there's a time we even slept in a trailer. There's a time we even didn't have clothes. We were not even showering. It was very hard, very hard for us. But um, maybe I'll let her just give an instance of uh, the hardships that uh, we have uh, had to go through. Yeah, so uh, guys, it has uh, really not been easy for us. And just as she had said, we have uh, struggled so, 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 so much. So much, especially on her part. She has struggled and uh, may just uh, God bless her so much as a mother. She has come through for us. You know, it has not been easy, especially with four kids, not having anywhere to sleep, not having any food. And uh, maybe just to say that uh, we've had it rough. But uh, here we are. And uh, we thank God. And uh, if it was not for for him, we would not be here. And uh, maybe I've just remembered another story. Uh, we didn't have that day. I can remember we didn't have any kawaida. We were not used to eating. And uh, yeah, we were not even breakfast, even supper. Most of the times we could go without food, even for a day or two. And we would borrow from neighbors. We would borrow from anyone. We would even pretend at times we are crippled and sit at the roads with a with a, like a plate, just for when people so that when people pass by they can put coins in the plate for us to see something to eat that day. It was not easy, right, man? Yes. Yeah, and even uh, once I remember when I was uh, a bit of age, I even used to go and stand at Koinange. So that I can just get something to 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 put on the table. You remember, ma'am? Yes, I remember so much. Mm -hmm. So it was not easy, guys. It was not easy, but here we are, and God has made it possible. So without much ado, I would let I would uh, really like to um tell my mom. Thank you, but this is <laughs> this is a prank. <laughs> But this is a what? This is a prank. And you've got enough. And so, Meona, my mom, for me, she can lie. <laughs> She can lie and she can say anything. You are too. Hi, the way she was accepting everything. I will be able to accept everything. I will be able to accept everything. So to my kupata mom, this was a prank, and I've done this prank because you even don't know I have a YouTube channel. Hey, watch out, guy. 
Itai. Itai si. Itai. Toa. Udah jual apa ya? Kita apa? Tanya omel mama. Kian tuh kian tak korok. So anyway, well, part of the story was true. Mm. Yeah, yeah, soko. My mom had a soko, but she actually struggled with it. And uh, maybe just to make things clear, my dad has always been in the picture. He's a great dad. He's taken care of us. I met Somesha. I couldn't go near the drugs in Lia. Wow, and wow. This video <laughs> was just one ama mama yangu anaweza flow and you've seen she can lie <laughs> she can lie and yeah, lie because for of me <laughs> so yes you're the best mom in the whole world <laughs> Hi guys. so that brings us to the end of uh, this video the prank slash reaction video you've seen that my mom can lie and say anything just to see me succeed <sighs> it was just the best i had the best time shooting this video it felt so amazing and most of the times i felt like laughing but i had to you know to pretend that i'm not but yeah that is uh my mom i really love her so much and uh I think that brings us to the end of this video. Kama kawaida, please subscribe, like, comment, and uh, tell me what you'd want to see next, you know. Advice on what you'd want to see me do, places you'd want to see me visit, if I'm able to, why not. So, see you on my next video. Bye-bye from me.